I am Lindsay Coffey, Miss Earth USA 2020. Most people know me as a world traveler visiting major cities around the globe. I apply my degree in political science to promote environmental legislation and encourage voter registration. But what shaped me into the compassionate and hardworking woman I am today is my upbringing in a small countryside town in Western Pennsylvania. I spent much of my youth outdoors surrounded by farms, woods, and animals. I connected with nature on an intimate level, opening my eyes to all of Earth's creations. The land of the free is the third most populated country in the world, home to 331 million people. The United States population is one of the most diverse. Along with its many natural wonders, we are the only country to have all five of Earth's climate zones, tropical, dry, temperate, continental, and polar. To experience an exotic natural environment, visit one of our 62 national parks, seek a wildlife refuge, or experience a marine reserve. Alaska has been labeled the last great wilderness of the United States as only 160,000 acres out of 365 million have been impinged upon. As 95% of Alaskan land is protected, it is one of the few places in the USA with intact landscapes allowing ecosystems to function naturally. Our conservancy efforts preserve the integrity of the natural flora and fauna while promoting sustainable living. America is the third most visited country and eighth in the world for the most national parks. The primary focus for U.S. parks is water. Tourists travel from all over to see our waterfalls, lakes, rivers, and our 95,000 miles of shoreline. In addition to creating a beautiful travel experience, our shorelines and national parks provide water for human use and ecosystems. Despite this vast amount of water, we are still facing a global water crisis worldwide. The Earth's usable fresh water is limited due to pollution, overuse, lack of, and outdated infrastructure. I am passionate about our Earth's water crisis because it carries the most immediate risk due to the harmful effects of climate change as it influences humanity and regional stability. Advocating this crisis is imperative as water stress is projected to increase in the coming decades. Fortunately, we do have solutions. Globally, we must recycle wastewater, increase efforts in harvesting rainwater, focus on ecological restoration, and rely on desalination. Individually, we must all do our part, using the five R's as guidance to our actions. Rethink, reduce, reuse, recycle, and respect. I show my respect for Mother Earth by following the five R's as well as volunteering. Through tree planting, gardening, cleanups, petitions, door-to-door -door canvassing, and my advocacy, I use my voice to speak for our planet. In the future, I plan to assist in the implementation of environmental protection laws and to promote sustainability on a global scale. I want to be Miss Earth because I know what it means to be more than my country. In America, I have seen the consequences of legislative actions contributing to the climate crisis. I have experienced water scarcity in South Africa, poor air quality in Mexico, and deforestation in the Peruvian jungle. But I have also seen the beauty of our planet and why it is worth fighting for. I've walked on the holy grounds of Jerusalem, driven through the outback of Australia, swam through the crystal clear waters of the Caribbean, immersed myself in the beauty of the Swiss Alps, ran my fingers through the water of the Jordan River, walked alongside zebras in Zimbabwe, picked grapes from the orchards of Tuscany, walked on the brilliant beaches of Cyprus and basked in the wonders of Machu Picchu. The only way to win this fight is together. The only way to win this fight is to be more than your country. I am Lindsay Coffey, Miss Earth USA, and I am Woman of the Earth.